friends, it's me. Today we are going to be mixing every sauce from every fast Every Chick-fil-A sauce. Every Chick-fil-A salad dressing. Every Taco Bell seasoning. All the McDonald's sauces. Burger King sauce. I went to Burger King and asked for some fries and every sauce they got. I feel like you gotta buy something not to make it awkward. I don't walk in like, give me every sauce you got or this whole place is gonna blow. Can't forget Kane's secret sauce. They did this, whatever that is, and some more ketchup. Look inside this bag. The sauce kind of exploded. Are these all the same? This looks like ranch, blue cheese, and whatever the yellow sauce is. Maybe honey mustard. Why did they give me so much sauce? The box is even covered in sauce. Is that it? Before we make our fast food sauce soup, we're gonna take every sauce from one restaurant, mix it together, try it, and then put it in our cauldron of special sauce. First up, McDonald's. Barbecue sauce. Hot mustard. Oh, they got a hot mustard and a honey mustard? All right. I feel like this is healing my childhood trauma of mixing all my shampoo and conditioners together in the bathroom, except this time I won't get in trouble for it. Sweet and sour sauce. My hands are so slimy. Can't do the lid anymore. Oh, this is the good stuff. Mmm, kind of look like caramel sauce. I feel like this video is gonna be a really good idea or a really bad idea. Spicy buffalo sauce. McDonald's sauces look good. They're so saturated, so colorful. And then of course the McDonald's honey. Now I feel like this is gonna be a little bit sweet, a little bit spicy, a little bit salty. Mix it all up. Or it's gonna taste like some McVomit. Okay, nice orangey color. I got some fries and I got some wings. <laughs> We're gonna try it. Ooh! The buffalo is very overpowering. I feel like it just like smacked the rest of the sauce. It was like my time to shine. That's all I taste, honey buffalo sauce. Every other flavor just disappeared. It's not terrible, but I wouldn't recommend. I got some wings from Wingstop. I got them naked so I can really taste the flavor profile. I'm gonna give this a six out of 10. Into the soup you go. For a minimum amount of dishes, we use in the same cup. So Wingstop only gave me three sauces. I'm guessing this is the honey mustard, BC, birth control, British Columbia. Ah, blue cheese. Something that chunky can only be blue cheese. Or bacterial conjunctivitis. Don't Google that. And then of course, the ranch. This looks foul. Should I wash the fork? It was like a little added seasoning from the previous secret sauce. I don't like this. I don't like the color of it. I bet this smells foul. That smells like blue cheese. Dunker wing. I'm not getting any of the honey mustard, which is a shame because I love honey mustard. It's just, it just tastes like blue cheese and ranch. Wingstop's ranch is actually not that good. I feel like the ranch is bringing it down because it's such a low quality ranch. This is like the Hidden Valley Ranch. It's like, I don't understand why it's hidden. It's not even that good. It's like you hide in a $2 bill. Into the soup you go. So I went to Chick-fil-A and you know how it's mostly like teenagers working there? Well, the dude taking my order was older. I think this was his first day. He was like learning how to like put everything in. He seemed to need a lot of help. He was like 60. I don't know if he was just like released from jail or something. The zesty buffalo goes in first. But like I was doing another food video, so I ordered a bunch of stuff, nuggets, fries, I think that's it. And then I asked for every single sauce. And he's like, every single sauce? He looked at me like, who comes here and orders every single sauce? I'm like, why wouldn't you? Like, what if it was my first time having Chick-fil-A? Just like it's your first time trying to work the iPad or a branch. Chick-fil-A's branch is elite. I wasn't even done ordering. I still needed like more things. I was like, I need an empty salad container. I feel like I have to explain myself. Like, I I'm doing all these hacks. I need you to hook me up with all these things. And they just look at you like you stupid. Like, what's wrong with you? Asking for all these sauce. He plugged it in. And then I was like, can I get one of every salad dressing too? Because we're gonna be using that for this video. And then he was like, salad dressing? What do you want salad dressing for? You didn't even order a salad. And then that really put me on the spot. I started to get defensive, like maybe I should just go to another Chick-fil-A. Barbecue sauce. And he was like, you need to pull up to the window, tell him what you want. You didn't even let me finish my order. Like he, he didn't want to deal with me. So I pulled up to the window, they had my order ready. I'm like, I'm not even done ordering. Like I just asked for one of each sauce. I, I think that's kind of reasonable. Chick-fil-A sauce. Oh, Polynesian sauce. It's basically like a sweet and sour. Yo, he didn't even say my pleasure. That's how you know he's a newbie. I've never felt so disrespected at a Chick-fil-A drive-thru. Might as well smack Ooh. me and spit on me. Sweet and spicy sriracha. I hope we get a nice red color. It seems like these sauces are all pretty red. And then of course the honey mustard. I hate to waste the Chick-fil-A honey mustard on this video. These are so good. Honey mustard is my favorite. Dusty, musty, crusty fork. We're gonna mix her up. Oh, hee hee hee. This looks good. Looking like some peach puree. Make a milkshake out of this. Nobody will know. This might actually be the best one. This looks very good. 
Oh, smells good too. Except that whiff of ranch that I got. I didn't like it. I got some Kane's naked tenders. Oh. <laughs> Really suspicious. They're squishy too. Oh wow, this sauce, that is so good. If it weren't for the ranch, this would be like, I would actually mix all the Chick-fil-A sauces and eat them like this. It's like the tiniest bit of spicy. It's mostly sweet with a little bit of tangy. Oh, this is good. I'll give this an eight out of 10. Into the slop you go. Cane's is quite simple. We got the cane sauce. You know, I've never had cane sauce before. Ooh, that's pretty good. It's like in and out secret sauce. That's what I forgot. I forgot the in and out sauce. It tastes like it has freshly ground black pepper in it. That's good. And then some Louisiana hot sauce. Okay, I don't know if this is gonna be good together. I don't like hot sauce. Oh, Louisiana, they don't play around. Bone apple teeth. I just dipped it so you can see it. I just want a little bite. Oh, this chicken been sitting out for a while. I don't trust it. Okay, okay. Ooh, man, if you drop to that sauce, fatal for us mild sauce enjoyers. That's spicy for real. Nine out of 10. Heard that plop? That's what good sauce sounds like. A handful of Taco Bell sauce packets. Like what, are these all spicy? You know, we're gonna do this in one fell swoop. Just get some skizzers and just, that's it. Save me a whole lot of trouble right there. Ew, this looks like it's gonna be really spicy. Ah. Uh. It doesn't smell that spicy. The last one was way spicier. Now I get it. It's like a little salsa sauce. I require a tortilla chip for this. Mmm. Okay, not bad. Oh, well spicy, but I can handle it. But I can handle it. And let me tell oh. <coughs> Why is it so spicy? If you like spicy, you gonna like this. Me, three out of 10. Into the Franken sauce soup you go. We we'll back at it again with the Chick-fil-A. I'm just gonna cut the lid off of all these. Honey mustard, give it the snip. Zesty apple cider vinaigrette. Oh, I bet this is delicious. Ooh, tangy. I've never even seen that one. Ranch. I feel like the ranch gonna ruin this cause it's like milk sauce with a bunch of non-milk sauce. Like the other ones are just like spicy and tangy and then there's ranch. Whoa, 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 wait, wait. The creamy salsa dressing. Why they got salsa dressing? How you got creamy salsa? Is it milky? Ew, it's like mayo and tomato puree. First ingredient, soybean oil. No good. I usually don't eat any oils except olive oil and avocado oil. This one is light Italian dressing. Ooh. Avocado lime ranch, this is one of my favorites. When I get a Chick-fil-A salad, I get the nuggets. I do not use this whole packet. It is so much dressing. Fun fact, I like to eat my salads dry. Or unless there's lemon, I'll like cut a lemon and then squeeze like half a lemon on my salad. But otherwise, I don't mind eating a salad dry. I like the taste of vegetables. The last one is light balsamic vinaigrette. Okay, we're about to overflow. This looked like a seven layer chip dip. Whoa! I have to be very careful mixing this up. It's going to overflow. I'm gonna spill some of it. This one's definitely a lot soupier. The superior soup, we shall see. Mmm, oh. I like this. This is surprisingly the best one I've had so far. You know, I wish I had a piece of lettuce to dip this in. Wait, a handful of vegetables. Wingstop gave me these. Okay, I feel like it's, it tastes like a healthy ranch dip. This is nowhere near healthy. This is actually really good. It tastes like a vinaigrette, but you put it with like a creamy sauce. It sounds like a creamy vinaigrette sauce. These went so well with each other. I'm gonna give this a nine out of 10. I don't know, Chick-fil-A sauces, they're just elite. And to the spicy soup you go. Oh, I can't wait to mix this up. It's gonna be so satisfying. Last on the list to complete the secret mixture, Burger King. I haven't been to Burger King in years. They got buffalo sauce. This is like the same old, same old. Can't y'all come up with something new and funky fresh? Oh, these are thick. Thicker than your average sauce. Sauce. Some ranch, sweet and sour, and honey mustard. Is that it? Oh, you know what? I have been forgetting to do the ketchup. So we're gonna add ketchup to this one. Cause this is like basically what McDonald's has. I mean, the Burger King basically copy McDonald's. It's like the same thing, except not as good. Okay, that should add a nice little red color to it. This one's jiggly. You know, I lost my fork, so we're gonna be stirring with a celery stick. Okay, mix that all up. This do be looking like a secret sauce. You know, I always thought secret sauce was just like a mix of all of the sauces. Like they just take like the excess or whatever's like left at the bottom of the barrel and they're like, you know what? We'll just like toss them all together and make a secret sauce. 
Ew, there's something in this that's like putrid, like disgusting. I'm telling you, the ranch ruins these. If you're gonna be playing around making a mixture of all these sauces, leave the ranch out of this, okay? I give this a negative three out of 10. This is Burger King, you really tried. Okay, here we go. The final ingredient to our special slop. Thank you, Burger King. We're gonna mix this abomination up. <laughs> I don't like the blue cheese chunks in this. They're too prominent. Let's get a good whiff. Ah, oh, smells like a tummy ache. Okay, what should I try this with? A cane chicken wing? I'm trying to find one that doesn't have sauce on it. Okay, here we go. It's not terrible. Somehow it just tastes like everything I just had. I've consumed more sauce today than I have this entire year. It doesn't taste horrible. You know, I might put this in a jar and like keep it in my fridge and like put it on a burger or something. This is surprisingly very decent. It's not a bad sauce. It's got every single flavor profile that you can possibly think of. It's got the sweet, it's got the tangy. It doesn't have the spicy. I didn't put enough spice in this. It's got the herbs, it's got the oils, it's got the vinaigrette, the balsamic, the ranch. It's like doing a little dance in my mouth. You see the chunks of blue cheese in here? Like it's a little suspicious. Not a fan. Call me SS Sniper Wolf or SSSS sauce. Super stinky sniper sauce, I guess. But anyway. Guys, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button and that <laughs> comment below. What is the best sauce? And make sure you turn on notifications. Click, click, and make sure you subscribe to the Wolf Pack. Oh, I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.